The Starboard software allows you to work with objects and their properties. First, click to open the Properties tab to view your options. To make changes to an object, first click on the Select tool. Notice, when I select the object, the Object Properties widget opens. Now you can easily change the line color using any of the pen styles, change the line style, width, or even add a fill color. To move an object, select the object, click and hold, then drag to your desired location and release. To resize the object, click on one of the handles surrounding the object and drag to the desired size, then release. Click and hold the green handle on the top to rotate the object. Anytime you select an object, a tap menu will appear. Clicking on the tap menu will give you even more options to work with your object. For more information on these specific options, watch the tutorials Creating Hyperlinks, the Gallery, and Layering Objects. Once you have an object the way you want, there are two additional options in the Object Properties widget, Lock and Infinite Clone. When you select Lock, either in the Object Properties widget or in the Tap menu, the object and its properties will be locked in place. To unlock, simply uncheck the lock box in the Object Properties widget or select Unlock in the Tap menu. Infinite Clone allows you to recreate the exact same object infinitely. To stop Infinite Clone, simply uncheck the Infinite Clone box. To work with multiple objects simultaneously, change to the Multi Select tool in your Tool Properties widget or in the context bar. Then, click on all the objects you want to change. Now, when you make changes, it will apply to all the objects you have selected. You will also find additional options in the tap menu, such as Align, and resize. You can group the objects so in the future they will always be grouped together. You can ungroup them by selecting them, click the tap menu, and select ungroup. Now you know how to use objects and their properties.